Hi, my name is Al Raus. I'm the Senior Technical Advisor here at uh, ProFire. Um, we are here to discuss a uh, couple of the trucks that we've built for the City of Vancouver Fire and Rescue Services. Uh, this one in particular is a uh, fire investigation van. This is the second one that we've built for them. We've uh, basically sat down with the, them and decided what they want to do, how they want to do it, how they want it laid out, and then we custom build the truck. Um, it's a lot of back and forth between us and the customer to basically get what they want rather than here's a truck, have fun. Uh, we've, uh, we spend a lot of time actually just tweaking different things and moving things around and changing how it can be put together so that uh, we can get it the way the customer wants it. We've added a whole bunch of different uh, items to the truck to make it more uh, reliable and efficient for um, the uh, department. Uh, we have an idle right system on it, which basically says that uh, we have a system built into the truck that if the truck is sitting there idling for more than 10 minutes, it will automatically shut the engine off, monitor the battery voltage and ensure that the batteries never go dead. And as soon as the system gets down to a certain point and the battery voltage is getting low, it'll automatically fire the engine back up, run for 20 minutes, charge the system up and uh, allow the batteries to get back up to full voltage and then it'll automatically shut off again. This allows the department to have all their lights on and not have to worry about how much fuel they're going through and the emissions that they're putting out. We have uh, installed a whole bunch of 110 volt uh, power into the unit so that they can basically connect up whatever they want to run computers, uh, monitors, coffee makers, whatever, and we've all had that wired into shore power so that if they're sitting at a scene, they can plug the truck in and it gets 110 volt power through the whole truck. Um, we've got areas for 12 volt power so that they can have chargers to charge uh, 12 volt systems that they may have. Uh, all these different things that will help them do what they need to do more efficiently. The truck uh, has a uh, complete emergency lighting package on it, has chevron on it, has all these different things to make sure that they're seen uh, when they're sitting uh, by themselves um, investigating whatever fire the situation they're at. Uh, we've uh, added a awning onto the side of it so that even if they're working outside they have an area to set up and keep all their uh, materials and that uh, from moisture and allow them to do their job more efficiently. That's basically uh, a quick little overview of the fire investigation van that we did for the City of Vancouver Fire and Rescue Services. Um, check back and we'll have other videos of other trucks that we've built and things that we can do that um, will help you do your job better. Thanks.